I'm starting today from Harrington Country Park. I'm going to walk right around the outskirts and finish off today at a very famous landmark that you'll probably know about. Oh, it's really cold this morning. Well, here at Harrington Country Park, what we're looking at now used to be very different. It was the site of a colliery. That's where they used to dig for coal. But 35 years ago, that closed. And now, Sunderland Council have turned it into an amazing country park with lots of wildlife. Should we go and see if we can find some? Come on. These swans are very big and powerful. Look at its webbed feet. The seagulls love sitting on these posts. And this is a young swan, a bit like a teenager swan. Can you see it's not pure white? It's still got some browny grey feathers. Here's a mallard duck. And a coot. Now there's a little moorhen. Can you see its red beak? The gulls are really interested in the bread that we brought along. Haha, <laughs> so are the swans. Do you know what this is? It's a life buoy. It's a floating ring, so if someone gets into trouble in the water, you can throw that to them to help them out. Here's a tiny little moorhen. It's got a red beak with a yellow tip. They're sifting through the water with their beaks, finding things to eat. Hey, this bench is clever. It's made of a huge piece of stone at either end and lots of twisted metal. Can you see the curvy shapes? And look, a boat carved into the stone and lots of circles. It must have taken a long time. There are lots of little islands in the lakes around Harrington Country Park where the birds can make their nests and be safe. These reeds along the edge of the water, they're important too. It's another place where small birds can hide and be safe. Well, we're leaving Harrington Country Park now. Uh, I wonder which way I should go. I think I'll go that way. We're crossing over the A19, a really big road that goes past Sunderland. We've left the A19 behind us and now we've got a long winding road to take us up to Hastings Hill. I think there's something on the top. Shall we go and find out what it is? time for a quick slurp of tea. Now here on top of Hastings Hill is a trig point or triangulation point. About 90 years ago in our country they started building these on the highest points of the highest hills around the land. There are about 6,000 of them and it was a way of measuring the distance between those points so that we could then make maps. From the trig point on top of Hastings Hill you can see a lot of the city of Sunderland. There's the Nissan factory. The tower on Cleden Hills. There's the Northern Spire Bridge. It looks tiny from here, 
and even tinier S Fullwell Windmill. Then we go across towards the city centre, Hendon and the port, and in the distance to the south you can see the ski slope. There's a tiny little blue tit in this bush. Can you see it? Can you hear it? Wait a minute, was that a cuckoo? It's a bit early in the year for cuckoos, isn't it? Although this sign means watch out on the roads, there might be horses about. Oh, can you hear them? We've arrived at Offerton Farm, and here's a huge barn. It reminds me so much of the barn that we saw at Beamish. Well, we're nearly at the end of our walk, but I've heard that somewhere around here there's a monument on the hill near Penshaw Village. Hmm. Which way do you think I should go? Oops! What does this sign say? Please do not feed the horses. Thank you. Oh look, it's another style. Here we are, we've arrived at the end of our walk at Penshaw Monument. Now I looked up on the internet to find out about it. It was built about 175 years ago to celebrate the life of the first Earl of Durham. It cost a lot of money to make, but for some reason they never got around to putting a roof on the top. Let's go and explore and see the views from Penshaw Monument. Come on. Penshaw Monument is huge. There are 18 stone columns, a stony floor and plenty of fantastic views. Look over here is Herrington Country Park where we started. That's the end of my walk today. Hope you enjoyed it. Oh, I know, I can sit here on Penshaw Monument and eat my baby plum tomatoes. See you next time. Bye. Bye.